think it's important for a person, in order to have a feeling of self-worth and a feeling of self-esteem, to have a purpose in life. Living a purposeless life, uh, you know, so what, what kind of significance is that, right? And tell the story of two vagrants who were arrested for loitering, right? And uh, the judge asked one guy, what were you doing when you were arrested? He says, nothing. He asked the other one, what were you doing when arrested? He says, I was helping him. If you're helping somebody who is doing nothing, you're doing nothing, right? And uh, I think if we have this kind of domino thing where everybody's helping everybody else, but nobody has an idea of what it's for. So I think we have to have a sense of purpose. And this may be where religion comes in, that religion says, no, the world wasn't a big accident. It was created for a purpose. And if you don't know what that purpose is, investigate, right? Look for a purpose in life, a purpose of the world and a purpose for yourself in the world. Because otherwise, to feel purposeless, my example is this. Uh, what kind of things have value to us? I tell people, go home and look at what kind of things you own. Right? There are some things that are uh, aesthetic, ornamental. They have no function, but they're ornamental. And there are some things that have a function, and their value is in their function. Okay. You have a beautiful grandfather clock. Right? It stops working. It can't be repaired. You keep it there because it's a beautiful piece of furniture. Right? It's ornamental. It's attractive. You have a can opener that goes dull. It's not ornamental. You throw it away. Okay. Ornamental, aesthetic, versus function. Those are the only two criteria for value. Okay. What about me? Ornamental? Yeah. I look in the mirror and I realize, uh-uh. No, not ornamental. Yeah. Well, my value then has to be on function. Well, what is my function? Is my function coming home from work, kicking off my shoes, putting on the slippers, sitting in front of the TV with a six can of beer? Yeah, that's not a function that can make anybody proud of being who a self one is. So I think that uh, in order to get a good sense of self-worth, and by the way, to give it to our children also, we have a purpose. What is my purpose in life? And within the family, what does this family stand for? If we look for a purpose, right? It was a very uh, great rabbi who says, the looking is the finding, right? Search, yeah, it's not a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Well, but as you search, you know, you develop your uh, traits, you develop your skills, uh, you develop your uh, philosophy of life, begin to search. Too many people don't search. Everything is taken for granted. This is the way the world is. So I think that we have to search for purpose. Many people will find a humanistic purpose. My purpose in life is of trying to make life better for others. My purpose in life is trying to do something about the environment, right? Uh, to, uh, to avoid acid rain, whatever. Okay. My purpose in life is to trying to do something about famine in Ethiopia. Uh, you can find a purpose, but you have to look for a purpose. Too often, people just go along, traveling along from day to day, without giving any thought into purpose.